Hi, my name is Alex and today I'll be looking at a great new orthodontic textbook from the United Kingdom. The book is titled An Introduction to Orthodontics. It's the fifth edition of this book, it has been published this year and contains 25 chapters from five contributors. Two of them are placed on the cover, Simon Littlewood and Laura Mitchell, whose book The Oxford Handbook of Clinical Dentistry I consider one of my favorite textbooks on general dentistry. But let's focus on what we have here. The book is richly illustrated and covers all the major orthodontic topics, from etiology to cleft lip and palate treatment. The book has a neat structure and contains a lot of useful clinical advice. Most of the chapters end up with key points summarizing the main takeaways. Sources of further reading are given and also the links to the relevant Cochrane reviews are present for most of the topics. The book also has a web edition where you can download a patient prescription for wearing the retainers and a patient card used by the authors. I learned many small tips and tricks here and there throughout the book myself. For example, the correlation between the depth of speed curve and space required for its flattening. I found the chapter on cephalometrics just brilliant. An author was able to cut down traditionally complex theme into a digestible piece of text and schemes that will be very helpful for young residents who are often struggling with the topic. The chapter also has a beautiful conclusion that goes, the aim of orthodontic treatment is to improve the patient's appearance, not to move them nearer to a cephalometric norm. I also enjoyed a chapter on hippodontia. I think this topic is not often covered in orthodontic textbooks, however, it might represent a challenging clinical problem. In the chapter, an author discusses different hippodontic cases and also various strategies to resolve them. I think this book should be a go-to resource for all the residents and also for clinicians who want to update their knowledge with the current evidence. This is not a book focused on a particular technique, but this is a great example of a comprehensive orthodontic textbook written in a cohesive and concise style that will equip you with enough theory to start a career in orthodontics. I think it wouldn't be an exaggeration for me to say that this is a British analog of the famous Profits textbook. I hope it was helpful. You can buy this book by clicking the link in the description below. Please leave me a comment, what do you think about this book yourself? And also please consider subscribing to my channel. Special thanks go to the Oxford University Press for sending me a copy for a review. As usual, I wish you good reads and stable results.